Hey, what is going up, guys? What is going up? Yes. Uh, what is going on, guys? It is Jbrom, and today, as you can probably tell by the title of the video, I'm going to be talking about my history slash plans with COD. Um, yeah. So first off, I want to talk about this gameplay. So this gameplay is probably definitely my best game in Advanced Warfare, um, at least ter in terms of kills and points, because I'm just going to tell you guys right now, I go, uh, I get 66 kills with 21 deaths, and I break the, like, point limit, like, over 9999, um, I think this was the first time I did that, that in this game, maybe the second, I don't know, but, uh, this game was also, it was a while ago, so, like some of the weapon buffs might be different or something um or the updates or something i don't know but um yeah continuing with this gameplay um so like the first half we were i was playing with my party that i usually play with you know cobble kids 2 and uh ikuddy and uh so the first half we were just kind of like going around captain flags doing normal shit and then the second half which is where the kills started to pick up um, we decided to just defend B, and you might call us campers, but, I mean, it, we're, we were playing objective, is what I like to call it, and we weren't really camping, we were just kind of controlling that middle room, plus they had walker tanks, so you can't really be outside when they have walker tanks. Um, but yeah, so the second half definitely gets more crazy. Um, anyways, back to my topic. So, my history with COD, um, I don't know why anybody would know this unless I've told them, um, in real life, because I haven't ever talked about it on YouTube, but, uh, my first COD was Call of Duty Black Ops 2, Black Ops 2, sorry, I'm kind of mumbling, but, yeah, my first COD was Black Ops 2, um, well, actually, technically, if you want to get technical, the first COD I ever played was Black Ops 1, um, I played the single player on the Wii when my friend brought it over, um, and yeah, so that was the first time I ever played COD, but the first COD I owned was Black Ops 2, and, um, it was right around, like, I got it right around Christmas, I didn't get it at release, um, and, like, I convinced my, I remember, I convinced my parents, because, the reason I never played COD before is because they were like, Oh no, it's M-rated, and you're not mature yet, so you don't get it. Um, but I remember I convinced my parents, um, because you could, like, turn off the graphics, like the blood graphics and Black Ops. Um, so that's why they let me got, buy it. Um, and I'm really glad they did. They're probably not glad they did, because, um, they got, because it got me addicted to COD. Except... Uh, I'm not addicted. I just I used to play a lot. I can say, but everybody does that with a new game because it's new, and they're like, "Oh yeah, this is so fun, man." But, um, but yeah, so Black Ops 2, um, as most of you probably were when you first played COD, uh, probably a noob, and you died a lot. So when I first played it, I didn't really play it that much because like, oh, I'm doing terrible. I don't want to play this. Then I'm like, oh, and, s and then in school I started thinking like, oh, when I get home I'm going to get back on Black Ops 2, and I'm going to uh, perform or improve my skill, and it's going to be the best. Um, so, yeah, those are the best times when you're just like thinking about like a new game, um, when you're brand new to COD or whatever, and you're like, oh, I want to be like those guys who are like going 66 and 21 and you know here I am going 66 and 21 like two and a half years later um but yeah so Black Ops 2 um not really much to say about it except for uh during the summer I did start playing it more um except that summer was also the summer where I played a ton of Minecraft um and I didn't really play with any of my friends except I did I did play with a couple um, but we didn't really play 
a lot together like probably once a month um and then so that's block ops 2 then my next cod obviously was cod ghosts and when ghosts first came out i thought it was pretty good like i thought i would uh really enjoy it uh because the guns looked really nice like the honey badger looked really good and i played it i i did enjoy it for quite a bit but uh i don't remember when but i just stopped playing it like i think it was right around the time the first dlc came out i played the first dlc for like an hour and then i just stopped and then i like i stopped for like a month or so then got back on played a couple months like played for the second and third dlc like all that time and then i just stopped completely after the third dlc didn't even download the fourth dlc um oh and by the way uh cod ghost i got the like the hardened edition or whatever so i spent 120 bucks on that which i mean but it comes with the season pass so it's pretty worth it um yeah i didn't but i didn't even get the fourth dlc for god ghosts because i just i was so frustrated with the game because it was so bad um and you might think i'm hating on god ghosts which i kind of am but it was just so annoying because it was only my second cod um and block ops 2 was like a really good cod in my opinion um that might just be because that was my first COD, but, uh, yeah, so, COD Ghosts, I didn't play it at all in the summer, I played Battlefield 4 and Destiny, uh, I got the Destiny beta, um, so I played a lot of Destiny for about, for like the whole summer, when it first came out, which was like in July or something, or August, I don't even remember, um, and then, uh, Advanced Warfare, uh, was released, all the info was released, and I wanted to get, like, I was debating whether I should get the Hardened Edition and the Season Pass, um, because God Ghost just turned me off of COD. Um, so, but, in the end, I ended up deciding to get the Hardened Edition, 120 bucks, got the Season Pass, and, like... I don't even remember what came with it, like, the, the cool box, and, um, Atlas Gorge, which sucks dick, and, oh yeah, and the bonus weapons, um, so, for about the, like, first half of the time I've been playing Advanced Warfare, I played alone, didn't really play with any friends, um, just because a lot of people got turned off of COD because of ghosts. But then right around like February, I would say, uh, one of my good friends, I don't even remember what happened. I think we were online at the same time and he just invited me and we started playing. And uh, that turned out turned out to be iCuddy, who's in this gameplay. He, we always play together. Um, and then, like, I don't know how long, like, a couple weeks later, I met Cabo Kids 2, which was, um, Cuddy's good friend. And so, I basically play with them all the time. I do play solo sometimes, but not that much. Um, and, uh, I don't even know what to say about Advanced Warfare anymore, because, it, like, it's really fun, it's probably I definitely play, have played this COD the most out of all the COD um, I've played oh and I forgot to mention uh, during the summer after Ghosts I played I bought every single COD for PC except World at War and Modern Warfare 3 um, I've played all the I've played all the multiplayer and all the zombies like extra modes and campaigns for everything except World at War and Modern Warfare 3, just because my uh, World at War is hacked, and Modern Warfare 3 just didn't seem that fun to me. Um, yeah, but yeah, Advanced Warfare really fun. Had a great time playing it. Um, now we're getting into Black Ops 3, 
Ops V is almost over, so I gotta hurry up. But Black Ops 3, really excited for that. Hoping I'm gonna be able to play that a lot because it's Black Ops series, it's Treyarch, it's gonna be Zombies, Zombies Real is tomorrow. Excited for that. If there's a trailer, I'm gonna do a breakdown, uh, which I was gonna do for the multiplayer reveal, but I just didn't really feel up to it, I guess. Um, so yeah, really hyped for Black Ops 3, don't know if I'm going to be able to play it a lot though, because I'm going into my junior year in high school, and if some of you who are in high school know, junior year is definitely the hardest year of high school, so I'm going to have to be focusing a lot on school and stuff, but hopefully, I know I'll at least get to play on the weekends, um, hopefully there'll be some cool stuff for Black Ops 3. And if you guys enjoyed, drop a like, um, and I'm out. Peace.